The government of Grenada, through the Ministry of Climate Change and Renewable Energy, has embarked on a mission to establish a solar plant at the Maurice Bishop International Airport. The initiative forms part of the country's push to transition from fossil fuel to cleaner, more environmental-friendly energy sources. The announcement was made on Sunday by Prime Minister Dickon Mitchell during a rally hosted by the ruling NDC in telescopes in Anjou. We will continue to invest heavily in solar. We are currently working on having a significant solar plant erected at the Morris Bishop International Airport. We are in the procurement stage and we expect that in 2026 and 2027, this solar farm will be built out. Addressing public concern over the increasing cost of electricity, the Prime Minister said the goal is to generate power from a more affordable and sustainable source. All our energy comes from importing diesel into Grenada and burning the diesel in the engines. Most of these engines are very old. I won't go into the history of it. So we have to look at long-term solutions to address Grenada's energy security and to reduce the cost of energy. Our sister Kareen James and the team at the Ministry of Renewable Energy have been working steadfastly on our geothermal project. It is taking a long time, it's the nature of geothermal, but we are committed to this project. Because if we are successful, we will get an opportunity to reduce the cost of electricity in Grenada. The proposed solar plant is expected to reduce energy costs, strengthen Grenada's renewable energy drive, and mark a major step towards a more sustainable future for the island. Rina Pia Thomas, GBN News.